Narcissistic individuals tend to have an excessive focus on themselves and an unwavering sense of entitlement. This behavior can make them challenging to interact with and they will only take action to assist you if it benefits them in some way. However, there may be instances we have no other choice but to request assistance from a narcissistic individual. To maximize your chances of receiving their help, consider the following five tips. Be clear and direct. Be clear and specific about your needs and the reasons for them. Avoid making vague or broad requests and instead provide relevant facts and information to support your request. Using emotional appeals is not effective, as narcissists view vulnerability as weakness and may see this as an opportunity to exploit you. Present your request in a straightforward and concise manner and avoid accusations or blaming language. Accusations or criticism can trigger defensiveness and result in a confrontation. Narcissists hate to be reminded of their flaws or mistakes and criticism is kryptonite to them. The narcissist may also punish you for making them feel inferior. If you have multiple needs, it may be best to prioritize and address the most pressing ones first and address the others later. Use simple language and avoid complex or technical terms, as this can be perceived as you attempting to demonstrate your superiority over the narcissist, which may cause them to feel as if their ego is threatened or them experiencing a narcissistic injury, especially if they do not know the words or terms you use. This will result in them refusing to help you, or even a conflict. Avoid threats or ultimatums. Narcissists are often highly reactive to threats and ultimatums. They perceive them as an assault on their control, superiority, entitlement, and ego. This can lead to a confrontational response characterized by verbal or physical assault devaluing, and false accusations. Alternatively, the narcissist may retreat and play the victim. Even if you successfully coerce the narcissist into compliance, they will harbor resentment toward you for taking away their control and may seek retribution, possibly even damaging the item they had to obtain for you or sabotaging you in other ways while still complying with your request, such as agreeing to take you to the airport but then driving slow on purpose, making you miss your flight, while they blame you for not being ready early enough. Additionally, using threats may also make it harder for you to get their cooperation in the future. It's important to keep in mind that narcissists hold grudges and do not easily forgive those who have caused them narcissistic injury or manipulated them. Appeal to their ego Overt narcissists, especially those who are charismatic, are more receptive to this approach. But most narcissists have a strong sense of self-importance, so complementing their skills, achievements, or qualities can boost their ego and motivate them to help you. Showing your appreciation for their help can make them feel valued and important, which may increase their motivation to help you. You can also make the request personal by explaining how their assistance will benefit you specifically, which can make it more appealing to them as they'll probably go off and brag how they saved you from disaster or helped you become successful. Try to appear genuine in your compliments and requests, as insincere flattery is likely to backfire and harm your relationship with a narcissist. They can detect dishonesty and insincerity easily, as they use those tactics themselves. Keep your emotions in check. Narcissists enjoy manipulating and controlling others' emotions. They may attempt to elicit negative emotions such as anger, fear, or sadness in response to your request. It's crucial to maintain emotional control, as giving in to their baiting tactics can diminish their motivation to comply with your request. They may also use your emotions as an excuse to start a confrontation. If you feel the conversation is becoming emotionally charged, take a break and revisit the discussion when you are more composed. By remaining calm and not giving in to the narcissist attempts to provoke negative emotions, they are more likely to comply with your request as they lose interest in manipulating the situation. Set boundaries. Narcissists hate your boundaries as it limits their control over you and reminds them that they are not superior to you and all-powerful. It also limits their manipulation tactics. Thus, they will push back against your boundaries and call you unfair, selfish, unreasonable and even that you are manipulating or abusing them. However, 
it is important to set and enforce healthy boundaries in any relationship to protect your well-being and limit the effects of their negativity on your life. Many narcissists also respect people more who stand up to the narcissist and stand up for their rights. A narcissist is more likely to do as you ask of them if they respect you. State your boundaries clearly as well as the consequences of violating a boundary. Then consistently enforce a boundary with the consequences. If these tips do not help you get what you need from the narcissist, then there is not much you can do but try to obtain it yourself or from another person. You may then also need to reevaluate the relationship you have with a narcissist and consider if it's not in your best interest to plan on ending it. What's the video suggested to you now to discover the price you will pay for loving a narcissist?